get into that part. I'm just gonna stick to the, he played y'all to go viral. I'm sticking to that. Not allegedly or nothing. He knew the outrage would have come from y'all. One thing about Derek, Derek know a lot of niggas have insecurities. Niggas don't like looking at this nigga. He's a big nigga. You don't like your hoe looking at this nigga. Without even knowing the brother, the first thing you did was like, man, F this nigga, Derek. And that's the problem. You, you have a situation where Derek understands the playing field. He knows this is gonna, it's gonna be like that ignition for the engine that you needed, bro. Derek knows and understand that all I need to do is push start the car, but I need an energy boost. And that's all my haters. Hope he goes, hope he goes, niggas do the most, and I can tell you, no reapers and no raptures, but you can catch them like you was creepers, and I come back just like it's a reaper. Take your lights out, these are my souls and lost. This video is protected under the copyright disclaimer of the Fair Use Act. Also, guys, hit that like button, share, comment, and subscribe. Salute to you guys. Thank you. Hello, YouTube family. This is your God bless. One thing for watching another episode of I Smoke Hip Hop. Man, this Derrick Jane situation, bro. I'm about to tell y'all everything about it. Let's keep it the truth. Let's just be honest. First of all, his wife did look crazy as hell on there with the bonnet and everything, but I'm not gonna do that. The whole Derrick Jane situation, the man is playing, y'all. He went viral for a noticeable reason. I'm gonna I'm I'm get to how he's playing, y'all. I never hated on Jerry Jane because I just disapproved with the type of content he does. I never liked what this nigga did. His type of videos, doing what he had to do, you know, um, um, belittling black men and saying that we the worst thing for black women, keeping the back and forth going between, you know, black men and women when we need peace right now. I, I don't, dudes like that, it's like a Steve Harvey, they keep it going. But instead of me hating on Derek, I just kept my distance. That's the thing, I just kept my distance instead of my shot. You know what I mean? I just kept my distance instead of hating, you know what I'm saying, on Derek. And the problem, I was trying to get my cameraman to go. I was trying to be professional. My bad, I tried hard not to laugh. I was about to say something in Cree, y'all, but I didn't want to hate on Derek because it was like, I seen a game he was doing. If black women wanted to be weak like that, docile, and let that man get away with all the ineptitudes he got away with, I'ma let y'all. I see the game player. I ain't gonna hate on another dude getting his money. Here's the problem though. Derek's situation was, if he would have just been up front, I would have rocked with his movement. Problem is, if he'd been up front, he wouldn't get the money that he's getting. This nigga wouldn't. I'm telling you today, that was the smartest hustle you can do. If you wanna get money, tell a black woman like, I'm not gonna name drop. Tell a black woman like a lot of these dudes do and say, you're the queen, your mother earth, God is with you. Your mother son, point at the sun right quick. You're the deity of the earth, you're the light, how the rays shine so bright. At night, you're the gloomy of all that echoes and creeps and through the, all that type of BS. And motherfuckers gonna throw their panties at you and everything else. It's one. And, and that's the problem of the initial cause of the situation with Derek. But here's the thing, y'all. If that's not what y'all cup of tea is, let that man do what he do, right? But you can tell niggas do hate niggas, bro. Oh, look, I'm not mad if you guys made a video against Derek, but everybody and their mom started attacking Derek. And I'm thinking like, damn, that means you guys, I'm not gonna say you have a shell or frallow ego, but it's like 100 million people versus one dude. Like get a grip of yourself. And here's the reality of things, bro. 100 people versus one dude. I caught the glimpse of everything, bro. Derek just played y'all. Pimp 101, Derek just played every single one of y'all. What Derek just did was, his numbers been going down since 2016, 17. His views ain't been the way it used to be. It's up there. I mean, it, when you a nigga that has their name trending, you always gonna be up there. But it's not really what it used to be. This man, like when his girl said she kinda knew about the situation, I'm not gonna even get into that part. I'm just gonna stick to the, he played y'all to go viral. I'm sticking to that. Not allegedly or nothing. He knew, the outrage would have come from y'all. One thing about Derek, Derek know a lot of niggas have insecurities. Niggas don't like looking at this nigga. He's a big nigga. You don't like your hoe looking at this nigga. Without even knowing the brother, the first thing you did was like, man, F this nigga, Derek. And that's the problem. You, 
you have a situation where Derek understands the playing field. He knows this is gonna, it's gonna be like that ignition for the engine that you needed, bro. Derek knows and understand that all I need to do is push start the car, but I need an energy boost. And that's all my haters, it's all my haters, you know what I mean? Everybody you see that's out there who's doing videos about him now, no disrespect to y'all, that man knew the attention he was gonna get. He got the Breakfast Club talking about him, old girl from CNN, um, Fox Business brought this up. Like, bro, that Fox Business, bro? This man is trending worldwide, bro. It don't matter if it's for negative or positive. He's making that cash spool out from this. You people don't understand the game yet. Well, how can he lose? Why does it matter if he cheat on his wife or not? He ain't the president of the goddamn United States. He's an average Joe Schmo like me and you who just got on YouTube and he talked about his situation and now he's trending and he's circulating. You know what I mean? So this, if anything, take, take point from Derek and learn what he just did, man. Cause I guarantee you, bro, when Derek be doing his little articulations and talk, you can hear the nigga in him come out. <laughs> You can hear the nigga in him come out. And I just be like, man, this nigga, man, I see it, bro. But I'm from Merrill's, bro. I, I see it, bro. But I'm not game recognized game. I may not like his cup of tea, but I respect the hustle, though. I, I honestly do, bro. Like, if you niggas 38 hot at Derek like that, what about Steve Harvey? A man that's been married like four times? Four times? Y'all y'all love him. Survey says. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. I can't stand his mustache, but anyway, that's another song. I can't stand, cut that mustache, Steve Harvey. But these these love gurus, you never see me doing videos attacking them because it is a hustle. It is a hustle. These white ones don't get attacked like that. These white guru hustles, they do these videos all day and nobody goes crazy. They cheat on their wife, get remarried and married again. Nobody says nothing because other white men who watch them just ignore them. We just, well not we, but look at me. You're a cool, cool, cool. <laughs> Bless one said we. I almost turned to one of you niggas one day. Now I'm just doing a joke, but on the reality of the things, bro, you gotta look at it. These white dudes ain't looking at their white counterparts who saving women out here. They ain't going cancel them. They just don't give a fuck. So why do you niggas care? I don't watch Derrick James. I promise y'all I don't. I hope he becomes the richest nigga in the world. And if our women like the being a docile mentality where you just need attention so bad that any Joe Schmo can make you feel good and tell you you're the mother god, essence of the earth, rays of the light, blue skies, yonders, trees, journeys. If it's on that type of note, then you need to be gotten in this game of life anyways. Remember, big fish eats little fish. It's the game of life, man. It is what it is, man. You can't knock the player or the hustle, bruh. At the end of the day, men, stop showing your insecurities, man. That ain't what real ones do, bruh. It do not look good. Because these other women out there, now they have more of a, 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 a inquiry about who the hell this Derek is. A lot of people didn't even know who he was. He's a smart man. Where he just That's marketing genius 101. What? There, there, there's a college prep team out there somewhere going, we need to get Derek to come give us a lesson right quick because that's how you market yourself. And I know that he even knows there's women, including your own wife, some women are looking at him right now like, I need to figure out who Derek is, just like they need to figure out who Kevin Samuel is now. Look, the, the point is not to really be loved, it's to be talked about. That's the whole point of this little in entity entertainment shit. Look, man, I'm your boy, Bless One, man. Thank you for watching another episode of I Smoke Hip Hop. Love your family. Love your kids. Stay blessed. Hit that like button. Share this video. Send this video to Derek so he can know, hey, bro, I, I don't rock with you, Derek, but I understand the game. Let that man know we are enlightened out here. You ain't the only one gaming these dudes, bro. Mother Earth. Moon. Essence of the sky. Yonder's moons. Earth. Wind. Fire. Watch her heart as her heart desire forever minds. Your queen beauty, black girls been magic, always, but not just tragic life, but they move from the flowers. Your heart, essence of rays, lights, moons, and yonders, journeys, thou me. <laughs> 
thank you for watching this video don't forget to like share comment and subscribe hit that cash app paypal and the instagram and email for men and women with a top-notch sense of style and look guys I, I wear it i just bought my own clothing and they're top notch for real look they're not just a top notch brand they're a way of life go get your own very own top notch brand clothing